Watch what I go on, guys. I mix them money and mix it up, you know. I H came show on this, you know. Watch what I go on. Alright, so you see why we mix up the shovel and like that guys. It spread out the aggregate in the shovel and evenly. Because when you use like a piece of stick or anything like that. You know, make the you know make the aggregate um smooth out evenly. You know, make the aggregate smooth evenly when you um, when you use a piece of stick. Now this is a project which we are doing in this Santa Cruz Rocky Hill St. Elizabeth era We are doing the shovel on application With the shovel on now guys This is the first time we are used this brand This brand is a brand from HKM. Um, First time we are using this shovel on uh, there's a, there are some disadvantage and some advantage with it. As in, the shovel on now is a bit, uh, it's a cheaper shovel on. Coming in a smaller bucket, I realize that this, com this company, HKM, they don't fill up the bucket right up. Even though it's a smaller bucket, they don't fill the bucket right up. I don't know why they don't fill the bucket all the way up. What I realized about this shovel and dog it's a bit toasty. So the manufacturer who are making this shovel and if they could have had a little bit more gum inside this shovel and it would have been good. It would have been good because what I realize it full of aggregate inside. So when you're creating the pattern, you get a lot of pattern from it based on the the, the, the amount of aggregate which is inside so I like that about it but otherwise with some other shovel on now like when it drop on the floor it's really hard to come off the floor when it, when, it, when it drop inside of it and stuff like that but with this one now when it drop on the floor up on the window I realize it's easy to clean off very easy from your wet a rag or use a scraper knife it come off very easy but for those other shovel on if it touch any part that you don't want it to touch I'm telling you it's gonna be very hard to come off so there is actually I like one thing about this we're having a lot of aggregate so when you're trying to make the pattern it gives you a lot of pattern and stuff like that I really like that but what I don't like about it is it it, it, it it shed very easily like when you join it on the wall it drops very easily it seems like they need to put a little bit more gumption on the inside of it so the manufacturer I don't know if you might see this video that's my experience on it but I like how you guys put in a lot of aggregate inside of it so we get a lot of pattern and you guys HKM you guys must fill the bucket right up you guys have enough this is like a four and a half gallon bucket and still yet you guys not full in this bucket so otherwise it's okay we're doing this job here in the rock hill we're using this shovel lawn for the first time it's a nice project nice house four of us on this job site oh god <laughs> create a mess right there so boy yes guys we're just going to take this project, let you see what's going on from start 
I'm gonna make this project into four different videos. I'm gonna make a part one, I have a part one, I have a part two. I'm gonna let this be a part three. And then I'm gonna have a part four, which is the finishing. So, this is it. Nice, 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 nice work getting done here. Okay. A9 bar, same way they're here, funny ground. Alrighty.